Gareth, we predicted a tight and edgy game and, uh, and it was, 0-0. Yeah, um, how it's 0-0, I never know. Um, their keeper is man of the match, you know, and, uh, and rightly so, you know, he's made some fantastic saves. Came for a lot of crosses, came for a lot of corners and uh, and that save against Lewis Wings free kick is phenomenal, you know. So the power of that was, uh, was enough to take it in, but he, that's why he's an international uh, and, uh, and fair play to him. But um, I don't, I don't think Pompey had a, a shot on target today, which is great. It's great testament to the way we're playing at the moment, the way that the boys are staying solid, resilient. Um, the wind was uh, the wind was howling today. You know, first half we definitely had it with us, and we knew that Portsmouth would have it second half. But again, the boys adapted really well, and again we created the better chances second half. So um, yeah, real, real blood, guts, and thunder as predicted. Um, just a shame we couldn't we couldn't finish it off today, but. Um, I don't think it's too damaging that looking at the results today and uh, the top the top teams can go and have their own private battle but there's definitely uh, three places to be uh, absolutely scrapped for and, uh, and as long as we're in that which we are it's uh, it's a brilliant place to be. Ruining those missed chances given the backdrop of the results elsewhere today? A little bit but you know you can't come to Portsmouth and expect just to win you know you, you've got to you've got to earn the right and we just didn't hit the target at the right times um, and when we did Bazuna was, was equal to it, you know, and uh, unfortunately it just didn't drop at the end there, you know, the pitch is in fantastic condition by the way, it's a real good pitch to play on and, uh, and I thought we played the better stuff, um, Gareth McLeary, Jason McCarthy linking up really well, Daryl Horgan, fantastic game from him and uh, and yeah, just uh, just missing that killer touch and uh, and that happens sometimes, but we'll, uh, we'll regroup now, um, the lads will have some days off because they need to recover both physically and mentally and all the boys um, who aren't playing mentally you know I've sort of I've stretched them as far as they can frustration wise they need some time off and they need to know that when it comes back we've got seven games to go clean slate let's go whatever decisions I make now let's get behind the boys because all anyone wants to do at this club is get promoted uh, me included and, and it would be a fantastic achievement for this club I know we were there last year but honestly this would be a fantastic year probably eclipsing what we did because um, this is a this is a huge huge league this season. Some of the teams in this league and and the season really is split into two, hasn't it? It's, it's a bottom and a top. There's there's no real middle ground, ground in this league, and uh, I think it's going to be the highest points total ever for a playoff, and I think it's going to be the lowest total going down. You know, it's it's a real split league, but the caliber of teams in it is uh, is making it that way, and uh, just glad we're at the right end. Not much goal threat from Pompey today, but it was a scare in the second half involving Ryan Tapazoli and George Hurst. Yeah. And, uh, and you almost came to blows with the manager, Danny. It got quite heated oh, in the I technical area. I would never come to blows with Danny. He's a, he's a <laughs> top guy. But, um, you know, it's uh, it's the referee's tough job. Uh, I think they were grabbing each other. I actually think that he's offside in the initial build-up, but obviously they've missed that, so the decision must be made. Uh, and there wasn't a decision, you know. Um, but I mean, you know, I could jump around saying that somebody should be sent off for smashing Sam Volks in the back of the head. I'm, I'm not going to do that. You know, I used to when I was younger, but uh, I know that these refs have got a tough job and, and you've got to you've got to play the game right. Um, yeah, it looks contentious. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I think Anthony Stewart's on cover as well anyway. But um, so I'm not sure it would be a red, but it may be a free kick in a dangerous area for them. Um, like I say, I'm just proud of the boys. Their, their goalkeeper was man of the match today. Um, and I think that that tells its own story. You know, we uh, we, we did everything but score. Um, really, really pleased with the way we played. But um, they're a tough team, Pompey. Danny Cal is a good manager. You know, he's got them organised. They're they're very tough to beat, and uh, he'll have this place rocking. Yeah, without a shadow of a doubt. You know, they 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 put faith in him, and rightly so. He's had some good success. Uh, so hopefully, he can he can turn this turn this place into it, what it what it should be, because um, it's been in the lower leagues too long and. Uh, but today we want to take the point uh, as probably the more happy club and uh, and see if we can get in this top six by the end of the season. And another clean sheet too. Another clean sheet, which is great. That's four in the last five, is it? Yeah. So losing all my stats here. The boys. I said to the boys, there's nine games to go the other day. There's only eight. I'm I'm all over the place. But um, <laughs> there's seven to go. I know that now. And when we get back, we've got seven cup finals. If we keep clean sheets in them all, um, we got a hell of a chance. Uh, I'm looking forward to it now. But I'm also looking forward to maybe just a. Uh, a couple of days off because uh, it has been really intensive can I just say thank you thank you to the fans today who travelled here because you are absolutely fantastic you outsang Portsmouth at times which never happens but I think it, that tells the tale of of, uh, of how this Wickham side now is, is really turning heads yeah I'm bad for a long ball team eh?